Now to a heartbreaking tragedy in Brooklyn. A fire kills a mother and three children. Her husband and two other kids left critically hurt. Taking a live look right now from Chopper 2 over the heavily damaged home in Sheepshead Bay. CBS 2's Jessica Borg is on the ground force there right now. Jessica. Tonight, fire officials are calling this a horrible accident. This is what's left of the home right now. Burned out windows, debris throughout every floor. Officials say the fire raged while nine family members were asleep. Some escaped, others didn't have a chance. You can see from cell phone video how vicious the flames were. Just hours before at the home here on East 14th Street, six kids and their parents celebrating Hanukkah, a community tonight in shock over the loss of life. It's horrible. It's horrible. It's like I can't even imagine. The fire broke out around 2 this morning while the family, along with a visiting cousin, were asleep. 39-year-old mother, Eliza Azan, was killed, along with her 3-year-old daughter, Henrietta, and 11- and 7-year-old sons, Moisha and Yitzan. Their bodies found near each other on the second floor. This, it's very, very hard for our community. It's very, very hard. Very sad. The two youngest survivors walking away with only minor injuries. The smaller boy overwhelmed with tears and inconsolable. Officials say some of the family escaped through a side door. A teenage son and daughter remain in critical condition, along with their father, who tried desperately to rescue his kids. He was severely burned. He tried to get back in to save his, the rest of his family. We believe he acted very courageously. The father, Yasi Azan, has worked for years at this popular Sheepshead Bay clothing store. They love his kids. And co-workers say he's a kind and friendly people person. They are praying he recovers. He was a patient person, which was, I thought was a very good characteristic about him. Fire crews arrived at the scene within three minutes of a neighbor's 911 call, but the house was already engulfed. Investigators confirming tonight the cause of the tragic fire was an unattended menorah with candles left burning. It's prudent to use this opportunity to remind everybody not to leave candles unattended, no matter what religion you are, no matter what holiday you celebrate. As is Orthodox Jewish custom, the funerals for the mother and her three kids will be held later tonight. They will be buried in Israel. We are live tonight in Sheepshead Bay, Brooklyn. Jessica Borg, CBS 2 News.